this is Spire 10. I know it's been a while and I was going to post a trailer, but then I thought it would take too much time, so I didn't. So I decided not to do it and stuff. Also, it's like videos are a little hard to make because I need time and stuff. And I'm not looking as for YouTube as my career choice. I have to put some priorities first. YouTube's not my first priority. However, I do care about YouTube. And the reason I make videos is for subscribers and popularity, not really money. Because money's really bad. It makes people corrupted. That's why governments corrupt a lot. Yeah, um... Now this video is mainly about Star Wars The Last Jedi because it has the internet talking. And I know what Disney like meant and stuff, so I'm going to clear some things up. This is all true. And I have some stuff to back it up. And I'll put those sources in the in my description. Also with the Harry Potter thing, it's fake and the description is fake. Thank you very much. You don't have to comment and it's not real. Okay, not real at all. Well, I guess it's real, but not a real trailer. Maybe I'll change the title, I guess, I don't know. Anyway, with Star Wars, Rey's not the last Jedi. Neither's Darth Vader, Snow, whatever the crap. But the fact that I have to theorize it means there's a problem. Star Wars is so simple. They just give you it, you just deal with that. You don't like, ooh, what if it meant that? No. Like, that's not what Star Wars is not meant to. It's not made for theories, it's made for entertainment. Th sure, theories are made for... Sure, theories are entertaining, but like... It, it wants you to think about it, but not like... Try to like... Do things that are never gonna happen. Because everyone's like, ooh, Jar Jar's a Sith Lord. Well, they have no plan for Jar Jar, and they don't care about Jar Jar. Because Jar Jar is stupid. Okay. Um, The Last Jedi is Luke. It's so clear. It's like everywhere. I'm like, Last Jedi, Last Jedi. He's called on the Force Awakens, so that's obvious. And red was the color of Return of the Jedi movie that starred Luke. So, it's a Luke movie. Okay. The last one was the Han Solo movie, now it's a Luke movie. And because Luke is a big role, I'm going to say raise the lights of Luke. Because lightsaber calling to you, like, oh, call to his father and him and now you. That's like clearly saying Luke's somehow related to Rey. Biological. So that's obvious. So that means that there's two options for Rey. Solo or Skywalker. That's it. Like Solo by Leia. Leia and Han. I'm not sure really where it was Leia, but that'd be awkward. Yeah. Um, I think Darth Vader's castle could be used. That is possible. That would be very interesting, but... The chances of that are a little slim, but I think they do have plans for that. Maybe a Darth Vader spin-off movie? I don't know. However, Darth Vader, Disney's like, you know... Let's just make him appear in random movies. Like, Darth Vader doesn't need a spin-off movie. That's how badass he is. So, you're saying Darth Vader is a little... Like, giving him a spin-off movie. Like, you're saying he's not powerful enough a character. Which he clearly is. He doesn't need a spin-off. He's Darth Vader. He will just choke you to death. That's it. He's that badass. He doesn't need his own movie. It's that simple. Sort of like the Captain America. Like, he doesn't really need his own movie. Like, he's that bad as a character. He can just have an Avengers movie, which is pretty much Civil War. Basically, it was a, like just not even a Captain America movie. Star Wars. Luke's the last Jedi, clearly. It's red because of Return of the Jedi. It's because masculine and singular, it's like. All in other languages. It's that simple. That's all I clearly know. I don't think they're gonna kill Luke off. That would be sad. I think they're gonna kill Leia off. Sure. She has a pivotal role as they sang. You know who did in the last movie? Han. And they went bye bye Han. 
And it's on, yeah. So Luke, that's pretty sad. And call up all these Force users. Luke's like the last one there. He's like survived all of this. Yeah. Um, I think he's the last Jedi. Like, why is he? Like, aren't there other one? No one survived the Academy. With that in mind, I think Luke messed up, and that's why he's the last Jedi. He's like, you know, I'm into the old ways where everyone's emotionless. And we just stare at sand. I love sand. It's so coarse, I love it. Like that kind of thing. And it messed up. That, that That's pretty funny. Like last time we did this, it messed up. Kind of funny with Star Wars and the prequels. So, yeah. Um, and... You know, this, like, dark side and light side, they kind of switch. Because now, the Jedi are the one hiding, and, like, the dark siders are the ones just have an order of millions of people. So it's very interesting. With that in mind, Ray will be, play a big part, but not that big of a part. She'll play a major part in episode 7. I think she'll play a major part in episode 9. Episode 7, more like... Luke. Luke and Leia, I think. Because the plot is big around them. And I feel bad for Lou, for Mark Hamill, because he was kind of misused in episode not episode 7. Because they just like made him take off a hood. It's ridiculous. So, I think it's going to be a great film. Really good. I think James Cameron's directing it. I think I don't know. Whoever it is, directing is good. Disney is smart with Star Wars. Yeah, I think they they may use. They also it's clear the story they're going. They're using legends, believe it or not. Legends. Han's kid turns evil, and like tries to get Luke's kid to turn evil too. And Luke's kid's like no. Eventually kills Han's kid. Han feels sad and stuff. So it's Leia. They all blame Luke and Luke hides away. They're kind of doing that a little bit, as you see. So I think Rey is Luke. It's it's obvious, it's clear. Star Wars, this isn't a theory, this is clear. Like, oh, it was there a Vader's lightsaber, it was a Luke's lightsaber, now it's you. Now it calls to you. That's like saying. That's like saying, um, that's Skywalker, that's Skywalker, and you are too. That's what it's like saying. Like Kenobi one, that, that's interesting, but I don't think so. I think it's Rey. I think what would be interesting is if, like, I mean, no, it's Luke, not Rey. Yeah. If, I think maybe they could give Luke his own, or like somebody, movie tied to Rey. It's not Kenobi, like they're just gonna do Kenobi movies. Kenobi was kind of misused in the prequels when they fixed that. That's why they're like all these spin offs, like it's like, oh, you want more? That's cool. Yeah, with the whole Darth Vader spin off, that's I don't think that's gonna happen because Darth Vader's so cool, he doesn't need his own movie. Han, we love Han, but like we need more of him. So. So, like, give him a song. It's like, Obi-Wan Kenobi, like, it's, he was misused a prequel, so give him a movie, too. This is trying to fix itself. I think that'll be interesting. What I think is going to happen in episode 8 is that Luke is trying to train Rey into something else, not a Jedi. Because they're like, oh, the Jedi way is wrong. It's like emotionless and stuff. It's wrong. It's not the true force. It got too scientific. They need to be more spiritual. And that's part of the Sith. The Sith were too spiritual. And the Jedi weren't spiritual enough. So I guess Luke's trying to combine it to like a great Jedi thing. So it's interesting. So with that in mind, I don't think they're going to kill Luke. And I hope they don't. They could. There is a possibility. They're they're gonna kill Leia for sure. I bet my bomb dollar on it. If I got any money from YouTube, I totally bet it on Leia dying. That's for sure. 
that's the for sure death. Kylo Ren, I hope he's cooler and he doesn't get beat up by a little by a girl. Like that'd be funny and all, but that's just sad. With Kylo Ren, in his in defense of him, he killed his dad. He probably feels pretty bad. That's why Snoke was a little bit like, "You're sure you're ready for this?" Cause like he was killing his dad. Like Kylo Ren's like, "Help me, Dad!" And like, killing Han didn't really help him. Made him more upset because he's like, "What have I done?" Because now the like dark side is again emotionless. Because like Luke's realized it's the bad emotions that are bad. Not all emotions are bad. Like, like, love's powerful, love's the power, like, it's cliche, but it's true. Like, would you, how are you going to get friends? By hating or loving? Probably by loving. That's how you'll get friends. By hating, you'll just be alone. And sad and depressed. So, I think it's very interesting how it's going on. No, I want to see how that plays out. For... Subscribers are Harry Potter fans. This isn't a Harry Potter sh show, channel. This is a nerd channel. I do things other nerds don't. Like, they haven't, like, thought, hey, who's gonna die in this? Like, they haven't combined it all into one video. And I have. S successfully. I think a trailer will come out between December and now. That's my bet. Maybe before that, sure, but I'm sure a trailer will come out by then. Probably, yeah. I knew they were gonna have something with an order. I just had this feeling. Yeah. Oh, for episode nine, let's just predict episode nine. Best shoes. The color is gonna be something like green. I think that's possible. Green or green or purple. I'm gonna say green. Maybe? Or blue. Blue would be cool, I think, actually. Blue, green, or purple. One of those. I think blue, because then you have three primary colors. You haven't seen that many blue colors. Like, blue's bright and also a little sad, so it's very interesting. So I think they'll probably choose blue or green. Green, like, Luke, like, towards the end of the movie, Luke has now a green lightsaber. So I think that's interesting. Yeah, um, with who, which one had the first Jedi planets? Like, what if, like, there was a weapon before the Death Star on the planet just, like, was destroyed before them and then no one would ever find out? I think that's possible. And with the Jedi, they lost their way. I think Luke's trying to find the way back. Which is cool, I think. Yeah. I think that's how, like, episodes, like, 8 will play out. I think it'll be very interesting and cool and stuff. Yeah, I hope you guys like this video. Subscribe, like it or whatever. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna try to get more videos. I'm not gonna really do trailers, I think I'll make that an annual thing. With Hillary V. Trump, I'm canceling that. Just like, I don't wanna be political. My political stance is that I'm not a Democrat, uh, I'm not a Republican, I'm an American member of the world. With Trump, I just, I can't picture him in a UN meeting and everything's okay. He's a narcissist and, I, and he's hard to trust. There's a lot of scandals surrounding him, and he can just manipulate people. And it's crazy. That's and I don't like someone like that. He's also seeming racist. I know he doesn't try to, maybe he does, but he kind of does. And he's also a little bit sexist too. So that I don't like Trump, but I guess we have to deal with him. Like, I guess let it be. Because nothing's going to change in my world. I'm not going to let it. I'm not going to let some orange guy just change things out of the blue. That's not how it works. 
Yeah. So that's my stance on Trump, Star Wars, Harry Potter, and all that. Yeah. Probably do a comic book video next. Yeah, I think maybe next I'll make a video on the age of comics. Because that's a little arguable. Like, so I think that's my next subject. Probably. I think that's easy to make. I made an article on that, so I can just base it off my article. That's cool. Uh, go to my PlayBuzz, like, account, like, that's where I started. Where you can, like, make polls and, and articles and stuff. It's kind of like a blog that everyone could do. And, and I'm easily con contactable on Twitter. Yeah. Uh, this is Fire Team out. Goodbye.